Hey guys, it's Nick with the Bass Hookup, and today we're gonna go over the ultimate Demiki rig setup for the fall, winter, spring. This head does it all, so stay tuned, you don't wanna miss. All right, guys, before I even get started with the video, I want to say that on Tackle Warehouse right now, if you buy $30 worth of first gen uh, jaw dropper, top spin, flash X, you buy $30 worth of first gen product, you're going to get a first gen hat just like the one I'm wearing right here, absolutely free. Again, on Tackle Warehouse, you can use the links in my description below to get any of this first gen product. If you buy $30, you get the first gen hat, $25 value absolutely free so you got to go get it right now before they run out it is a limited quantity so let's get to this video all right guys so you know there's a bunch of demiki heads out there on the market but what makes this head unique one is that it could pretty much do everything from demiki rig it's gonna add action to your demiki rig unlike any head out there you could throw ned rig on it you could throw anything you want on it drag it on the bottom Use it suspended, almost like a soft spoon. Okay, so something these bass have not seen before. So with this head right here, I got the first gen jaw dropper right there. As you can see on the head, it has a little lip on it. Now I know I've talked about it if you've seen previous videos, I caught a ton of crappie on it, but what the lip does is, initially when people see it, they think that it wobbles like that um, on the straight retrieve. It won't do that. It'll kind of make it kind of go in and out like that on a straight retrieve. But what it's designed to do is drop that bait, get it suspending in front of those fish, just like you would a Demiki rig. So you're going to drop it straight down and you'll see in this video, I got underwater footage. We have fish catches. We have it all in this video. Okay. So we're fishing in this video, 25 to 35 feet of water suspended fish you see them down there on the graph you drop it straight down right above their head you see them here on the fish finder i drop it right above their head and twitch it maybe pop it and so on the pop what this bait does it's going to be suspended just like this straight up and down when you pop it it's going to dance as you guys can see in the footage here it's going to dance left and right kind of like an ice jig that's what that bill does now with the 90 degree line tie and I tie it back here, my knot's right back here, it's going to sit perfectly horizontal up and down like that in the water column. On the back, I've been loving throwing this Baby Z2, Strike King Baby Z2. It's a last tech material, um, super durable. I caught, I, this is the same bait I caught all the fish in the video. Too many fish catches. We can't put them all in there. We caught a ton of them yesterday. Water temp dropped, it's down to 62 degrees. Um, those fish are kind of lethargic, but they can't resist that. It's just like a little minnow. So what I was doing is dropping it straight down. Either you could give it slight twitches of the rod, getting that bait to just shake. You could hold it still, it just sits there perfectly 90 degree, just like a little minnow just sitting there. And they come up, mouth it, kind of load up. You guys will see that and get them. Or if they're active, you see spaghetti, which is a bunch of fish down there on the graph. You could give it hard pops in that sack line and that thing will dart the harder you pop it the further it'll dart out left and right and go crazy so super versatile and if you're not using it like that in the demiki rig it's the best ned rig head okay if you're going to use an exposed ned rig head don't use a shrooms head or go ahead use a shroom head but try out try out the jaw dropper this winter all the way through the year next year they come in green pumpkin they come in a red green pumpkin which is also awesome with this minnow style bait on the back of it for spotted bass smallmouth they love the red green pumpkin head um, it just gets bit and put it put any type of little uh ned bait ned plastic you want on it cast it out it comes through rock phenomenal because the lip 
catches the rock and deflects off that rock kind of like a square bill would or something like that so it'll get a lot less snags than you would on a regular shrooms head you could just switch it out put a little paddle tail swim bait on it cast it and reel it if you want again super versatile these things are for sale everywhere tackle warehouse any little uh, mom and pop shop if they don't have it tell them to bring it in um, like I said tackle warehouse bass pro shop soon they'll be in Walmart's um, and what's really cool about the packaging is we're really trying to make these baits for fishermen we number one they have to catch fish we're fishermen we're tournament fishermen my brother fished the apex series this year which is the biggest pro series on the west coast he came in three top fives and won one of them so we want to catch fish first and foremost but we also want to make it easy um you know for you guys to understand what the bait is so in the packaging we have on the back right here on every package the top spin the flash x anything we make is going to have a qr code on it if you're in the store and you want to see what that bait does and i don't think anyone else has this if you want to see what this bait does you scan that qr code with your phone boom video pops up you can see that bait underwater footage of it it'll give you a little description of it how to use it short little video quick and to the point so you don't have to go scour the internet to see underwater footage because i know that's what i do with all my baits so with that said um set up real quick i got baby z2 i got a quarter ounce um glimmer shad jaw dropper on there i have eight pound p-line tactical um i'm throwing this on a just spinning reel spinning setup again eight pound tactical but what was really important in this setup um, and what just helps detect that that subtle bite was the Stealth Sticks rod here. This is a Stealth Sticks Skinny Pete. We have a, a couple different Stealth Sticks spinning rods and bait casters and by far the most sensitive rod that I've ever put in my hand. It's a carbon fiber rod. Um, this one's 7.2, two power. Perfect little spinning rod for this setup, drop shot, anything like that but super, super sensitive. When they bite it and I have a foot of slack line and it just is that little tiny, little tiny tick, I could feel it. I know they're on there. So awesome, awesome rod. Check them out if you haven't already. Stealth Sticks. Um, they are in the kind of upper end. I'd say around the 250 uh, price range. But if you're looking to spend that amount of money, uh, and or you like G Loomis and those sort of rods look at the stealth sticks super awesome rod now Let's get out there on the water show you guys some of these fish catches I'll talk about a little bit more on the water and then we'll come right back here and close you guys out. So let's go Oh, yep, oh, yep, Got yep. One. <laughs> oh, Found him on the graph. Up, Drop down that. That's all you got to do is find him. Swallowed it because let him have it so long. Jeez. There's more down there, too. Oh, that's a good one. Is it a good one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. One. Nice one. Nice one. Oh, man. That, talk about lethargy. Nice guys. one. Look at this thing. Not even biting. At oh, all. dude. There's a, there's a bunch down there, though. I got to get back. Oh, dude, there's a mega school down there, boys. Oh, yeah, that's a nice one right there. Right in the roof of the mouth. In the roof. But there's a mega, dude, there's spaghetti down there right now. In his face. Popping it, dude. Popping it. Spaghetti. Ooh, nice one, too, dude. Nice one too. Just like yours. Look at look at the graph. I gotta get this one in. Go back for another one. Again, dude, right in the roof of the mouth. Right there. Right through the roof. Little baby Z2. Dropping it down. Looks just like a little live minnow, about as close as you can get. Can't resist it. There's another one right here whole bunch of fish in this little stretch right here. Oh, oh, there we go. Going now. Oh, there's a whole bunch. Whoa! Look at the graph now. Oh, 
yeah. Now, now we on them. Here we go. Let's get fire here. Eat that worm on the jaw dropper. Go. Jaw dropper is jaw dropper is whacking them right now. Back down. What the? Oh, what? 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 What the heck? What the heck? <laughs> I got one that time. Woo! Broke it, bit. Birdie. Down right there, right above their head. Right above their head. Right now, I'm just twitching it. That bait's just dancing. I can see I'm above their head. I'm going to drop it down to the bottom. Sometimes you got to get under them and then just slowly slowly twitch and start to lift up and get like their eye level sometimes above their head and a lot of times they feed up so kind of want to be above them sometimes they'll come down to the bait like I had that fish do earlier but I see a couple fish down there they're suspended about three feet off the bottom oh god do you guys see that I almost pulled the rod out of my hand. I'm gonna get back down there. There's one on the bottom, so I'm just gonna drift right through that one. Yeah, the two I see on the screen, I was right above their head. And I don't know how I missed it, but it that one almost pulled the rod out of my hand. It pulled it so hard. Oh nope, it's on there. See that pressure on my rod tip? You guys see that? Just that little bend right there, and then you just down nice and slow. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Took down her. <laughs> That'd be, that'd be nice one. Oh yeah. Do it again. You got the. You got the. You got to do the Justin Lucas figure eight. Build ants it. And then you. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> he jumped in the boat. How do we just do this? Got them just like that though. Just twitching it, dropping it down to them. There's a bunch down there right now, but right in the roof of the mouth, little baby Z2 on there that I've caught tons of fish on. That's all there is to it. But when they bite it, you do want to let it kind of load up. Just don't set right away. It's, it is a soft plastic, so they'll hold on to it. But just let it load up. Let's see. I'm gonna drop it down again because I think I might catch one right here. on the graph. He's got it. He's on there. He's on there. Oh, he's on. Oh, yeah. He's on. It's coming up. It's coming up. There it is. Oh. Spit it. He spit it. There we go. Yeah, yeah. just come straight up to jump too every one of them look at right on the roof of the dang on mouth every time oh, that's a skinny one that one needs to go find something to eat i guess he was trying all right guys so i could not put every fish catch in there there were a ton of fish catches again if you 
and and I just want you guys to try these heads because because they're gonna catch you fish it's not because I mean this is this is one of the cheaper products that we make as far as cost uh, price point to it right I just want you to try the head because I think you're gonna catch more fish like I said if you're using it like a Demiki rig a swim bait on it a uh, Ned rig just dragging it on the bottom hopping it walking that thing on the bottom if you're doing any of that stuff you could use it all year round just get your hands even on one package try it out you'll get less snags you'll catch more fish and uh, I think you guys will enjoy that product and also we're designing a bunch more product for first gen we're always trying to think of new things I am super excited for things we have coming up it's probably gonna be a few months um, maybe a little longer but we want to make sure we get everything that we come out with perfect and dialed in for you guys and that it catches fish so looking forward to those things thank you guys for watching the video hopefully you guys got some information here that you could put to use this winter all the way through next year and we will see you next time <laughs>